Well, we are here today at the future home of Maryland's Purple Line here in Bethesda, Maryland. A big crowd gathered at the Bethesda Metro, where the governor announced $628 million in transportation investments for Montgomery County, including an additional $400 million for construction of the Purple Line. The lieutenant governor announced the Purple Line will be billed as a public-private partnership. A project that's going to connect our communities and grow our economy, a project that is going to add or expand 20 stations in communities in College Park and Bethesda, Riverdale Park, and neighborhoods throughout the national capital region. Not everyone in the crowd was happy with the Purple Line announcement. We would like to see the trail relocated. But local officials said improving the transportation infrastructure in Montgomery County will boost the economy and benefit all of Maryland. The transportation funding announced today will help Montgomery County move forward on desperately needed overdue projects. The county council also, understanding that we have to put forward commitment, did include about $100 million in our CIP to ensure that we could fund the Bethesda South entrance because we are that committed to moving forward. Obviously the Purple Line will help people from Gaithersburg as well. It will help people from the entire region. Quality infrastructure so that we can connect communities together, quality jobs that they'll be able to have through opportunities and places to live. All of that happens with this kind of investment, and so it's just a great day for us. To see the state committing to something that's so transformative, I think, for this county, it's going to really boost our competitiveness here in the region. It's going to make quality of life really improve for a lot of people. I think it's really good news. You can find out more about the state's transportation investments in Montgomery County by visiting the MyMC Media website. For MyMC Media, I'm Sonia Burke.